Welcome, this is the Energy Vibration Reading for all the Pisces, Sun, Moon and Rising. It is the first week of August 2017 and we begin to, from July 31st until July 6th. So this is going to be what a week it's going to be. It's going to be a wonderful week um, because um, the energy of temperance is here twice and the a zodiac energy vibration is fire you are a water sign but whenever it's the earth week with the energy of fire the earth week the earth people and earth energies are going to be protecting you and balance is going to come in your life so this is good this is a wonderful thing as we look your energy is going to be justice so whatever that was unjust, whatever legal suit whatever lawsuits you have whatever injustice that you had it's going to be a positive one for whether business or in love or so whatever legal issues that you have um, divorces or whatever that was happening with legal issue that has to do with legal issue whether in a business in love or in romance or you're divorcing um, it's going to be positive okay so that is good news when justice comes up with the energy vibration of uh, the two of cups that means uh, whatever situation that has play whatever injustice that has happened to you um, you and your partner it's going to be in balance okay so divorces could be end of divorces and this sort of a thing <clears throat> is going to happen so this is wonderful I need to put on my glasses because it's the middle of the night and I need to see your number energies and uh, um, the wheel of fortune is here and temperance and debt death and transformation so whatever that was going on um, with um, cause cause um, karmatic situations it's going to come to an end and the wheel of fortune is going to bring you the ace of Pentacles so isn't that wonderful um, the number nine energies number nine energies number nine energies number nine energies are very vocal in this week the number nine energies so number nine and nine to nine is going to be your energy vibration which is good this is wonderful this is a positive energy you have transformation of whatever car karmatic situation that has been happening in your life but a main focus in your week is going to be the eye princess so a lot of you Pisces in this week your psychic is going to be at the eye level whatever is happening you're bringing balance in your world your psychic is at a high level you're listening to your intuition you're going with your guides and angel and your psychic is going to be at the eye level so your week is going to be a week of psychic but with a psychic you're connecting with your angels and guide and deeds are bringing out positive energies in your life and this is going to be good um, it's so it says you're balancing the hurt the, the earthly world with the unseen world with the the mystic world and this is going to be positive for you um, 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 Pisces so this is going to be a wonderful wonderful situation um, it's gonna be good it's gonna be positive it's gonna be so good so positive okay the nine of starve the nine of starve is you are ready for anything whatever come in your way you're ready for it okay and uh, um, you are going on a new journey so whatever comes your way you're ready for it and you're about to start a new journey in your life so whatever that was there it's no longer there you are about to, to start a new journey so whatever obstacles that, that was there is now um, passed over and passed away and <clears throat> you are going to begin a new journey in your life okay um, as we move on to uh, Tuesday be aware on Tuesday whatever the situation is the two of sword is here um, you need to see clarity to a situation you have temperance so whatever the situation is you need to have balance you need to have temperance you need to ask for clarity to a situation whatever is going on on Tuesday so 
whatever the situation is that is affecting you on Tuesday you need to have clarity and balance on Tuesday because it's going to be an air energy where um, people um, the two of sword is not seeing something clearly and you need to see something clear so you can bring balance in as we move forward we have the energy of the eye princess which is your own energy vibration which is governing your weekend this is going to be wonderful and you're bringing stability and balance in your life you are bringing stability and balance in your life so whatever is unbalanced or out of bounds you're bringing back that stability and balance in your life so it could be money it could be work it could be your family situation it could be love relationship whatever it is you're trying to listen to your intuitions your guides and angels and bringing in balance in your life which is super 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 positive as we look at Thursday and Wednesday is going to be a positive day for you on Thursday you have the two of uh, starver and the two of starver is that a portal a doorway is about to open up for you and the knight of pentacles is going to do that for you whoever this knight of pentacles is he's going to do that for you he's going to open up that positive doorway for you and he's going to help you to build and move through that situation which is going to be good so whoever you meet um who is the um the, the a Taurus a Virgo or a Capricorn this person is going to open up a doorway for you and, and good things are going to be coming to you via this portal as we look we have the three of uh, um, starver which you're leaving something behind and you're ready for anything you're leaving something behind and you're ready for anything so it doesn't re really matter what is happening you have decided to leave the past behind you're leaving something behind and you're looking forward and you're ready for anything that is coming your way and this is going to be positive this is positive because you you begin the week um, let's go forward um, as we look at Saturday you have a situation with a soul family or a group of soul people and there's going to be a transformation so if you had a karmatic lesson that you um, was learning there comes an end and there's going to be transformation so a lot of you were dealing with car some karmatic situation and there comes an end on Saturday and you're moving forward as we go forward and Sunday you have uh, the ace of coins and the wheel of fortune oh my god okay damas and ladies and gentlemen this is wonderful this is extremely wonderful the ace of pentacles is bringing you the wheel of fortune of the wheel of fortune is bringing you the pentacles whatever way you're looking at it is going to be and the eight is here is going to be financial abundance is going to come to you because the world is as if you are leaving something behind on monday and this is so positive you're leaving something behind on Monday going on in a new journey so and Wednesday is a positive day because you listen to your intuition you listen to your guidance and you see this because the number nine energies is the spirit world is ending something in your life and moving you to something which is much better and the night of coins is going to come in a Taurus a Capricorn or um, uh, a Virgo is going to come in and help you with that and what is happening here is that on Friday you decided to throw away whatever is happening leaving the past behind and you're ready for anything it's as if you know you're standing there posing and ready for anything in the weekend it's going to be wonderful because whatever karmatic situation that you have been dealing with is going to come to an end and this is good because it's a past life situation whatever you're dealing with it's going to come to an end and when that come to an end you have the ace of pentacles and the wheel of fortune and this is going to be extremely positive so this is a good good week for you um Pisces it's a wonderful wonderful week um, love in this week it's all about you leaving the situation karmatic situation that has been happening in your life and lessons that you need to learn and you know you have uh, realized that uh, the lessons that you have learned 
it's been learned and uh, you can finish and put the point behind this lesson and move on and that's all it's about because whenever you decide that you have learned a lesson the universe is going to bring a transformation and it brings you the ace of pentacle which is bringing the wheel of fortune please dumb, uh, ladies and gentlemen buy the lottery whatever it is buy the lottery in this week okay the message that I have here is your root chakra so whatever this was happening with your financial situation you need to call upon Archangel Gabriel supervisor tone helmet master fire and fire salamander to heal your root chakras and this is going to be good as you heal your root chakras you're going to see put your financial situation is going to start being good so let's look at the situation and see what the Oracle has and it says exchange of gifts yes because the ace of pentacles and wheel of fortune comes out this is going to be wonderful so whatever the situation is whatever the situation is whatever the situation is now uh, ladies and gentlemen remember that you are vibrating on an eye vibration in this week and you have exchange of gifts and this is true exchange of gifts so this is going to be wonderful uh this is a good good um message to exchange of gifts the law of giving and receiving currency trading of weighing cost and determined value you're entering a, a positive and enrichment time when all manner of opportunities are being offered to you you have everything you need to seize them yet in order to honor them yet in order to honor them you must put in the time exchange your experience and skill and committed art and soul to what you are choosing to pursue you can do it you have what it takes to be a success if you are aligned with the law of giving and receiving. You must engage in the dance of giving and receiving, pushing and pulling, and doing and being. If you let fear guide your choices, you could compel yourself or create an imbalance. This is not a time of just do, do, do. Your, use your currency wisely, uh, giving and receiving, mindful of the values others bring to your life. And this is going to be wonderful. So, um, uh, ladies and gentlemen, I'm leaving you with a positive message. Remember, as we give and we receive, there comes new positive edges in our life. Please like, share these videos. I want to say thank you to all you Pisces. It has been a wonderful, wonderful, positive year so far. Thank you for your support and I'm saying namaste until next time.